What is aesthetics? Some scholars view aesthetics as a theory of beauty, while others view it as a discipline that is concerned with the appreciation of beauty. Indeed, it is quite difficult to pin down the exact definition of the term aesthetics. As a matter of fact, new views of this theory have developed in recent years. For example, in science it is defined as the study of sensory or sensory emotional values, which is sometimes understood as judgments of sentiment and taste. In the social sciences, it is commonly understood as a critical reflection on art, culture, and nature. In the art discipline in general, the term aesthetics relates to particular branches of art, such as art theory, literary theory, film theory, and music theory. Broadly construed, however, the term aesthetics, which etymologically speaking, comes from the Greek word aesthetikos, meaning aesthetic, or pertaining to sense perception, refers to the branch of philosophy that deals with the principles of beauty and art. It is also important to note that some scholars separate aesthetics and philosophy of art in the sense that the former is generally understood as the study of beauty, while the latter is the study of the works of art. However, Based on the above definition, aesthetics encompasses both questions about beauty, and art. Hence, although not exactly the same, the line that divides the fields of aesthetics and philosophy of art is blurred. In fact, both fields ask similar questions, like what is art? What are the things that count as art? What makes good art? What is the nature of aesthetic experience and aesthetic judgment? and what makes something high art, as opposed to popular art. In addition to questions about the nature, characteristics, and dynamics of art, aesthetics also asks questions about the meaning, nature, and dynamics of beauty, such as what is beauty. What makes aesthetic objects valuable or beautiful? Or who determines the meaning of an artwork, the artist or the audience? Aesthetics also addresses questions regarding taste. For example, if two individuals disagree about the beauty or aesthetic value of a particular artwork, is there an objective truth of the matter? There are also questions about the difference between beauty and the sublime, and questions as to whether people can judge the diverse fields of the arts in the same way, or if separate theories are needed for films, songs, paintings, drawings, sculptors, and the like. As we can see, aesthetics covers both natural and artificial sources of aesthetic experience and judgment, and examines topics such as aesthetic objects, aesthetic experiences, and aesthetic judgments. It also considers what happens in the person's mind when one engages with aesthetic objects, such as reading novels, listening to music, watching movies, and viewing visual art.